everybody, welcome to another video. This is La Belle. And for this video, I'm just walking you straight into how to install your list. So, if you are new to my channel, I want to say welcome. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, please make that move to subscribe. And if you are returning subscribers, you are welcome. I know I have not been consistent on this channel, and I know consistency is very important for YouTuber. The more you come out, the more people get to see you and the more they subscribe to your channel. I know I'm not very consistent. I'm sorry, y'all. But I'm going to try my best to be consistent out there for you guys. So, let's watch creep into our video for today. Yes. I'm going to show you guys this hair. It's very beautiful. It's very pretty. Uh, I got this hair from Epia. I don't know. It's a Chinese word. It's a Chinese company. I say Epia or Epia or whatever. But for me, I pronounce it Epia because I'm, you know, I don't know how they pronounce it, but I pronounce it Epia. So this hair is 100% on processed human hair. So this is my first time ordering from this company. I've been following them on Instagram for a very long time. So I just gotta give a try. This is your Google hair. But this particular hair that I got, it was on sale. So I like, you know what, let me just try to see their hair because this is my first time. You know, you just don't. But I have on everybody, you know what I'm saying, right? So it was not expensive, it was just one hundred and twenty-one dollars. So I, you know what? Let me just go for it and see how it's gonna look. Their shipping takes three to four days and it came right on time. Uh so this is the package it came in. And it came in this. It came with a ball cap. And this is the wig. It's 20 inch straight wig. Yeah. I know I get straight wig before. I always get new body wig. But look, guys. This is a teapot wig. Jeez. <laughs> look at the middle. And look at the sides. Look. This is 20 inch. This is my first time doing a frontal install lace on my channel. You know, that's the reason why many people don't know. You don't just get hair from anywhere. When this hair was on uh, the website, they said teapot, and I have seen teapot. I have seen have two different kind of teapot. I have used teapot before frontal teapot, and it wasn't like this, but this. I don't know, look at this, it's very small. The teapot that I use, you can get a side part, you can get a middle part, and whatever. But I don't know, this just looks so small. I don't know if my hair, I know it looks messy, but I love it. I want to record it not, because why can you bleach? But this hair is already processed, so I guess I'm just going to install this straight into my hair. But the first thing I will do is just to put my cap on my hair. But you guys know that I have walked you through that process, how to... Make your bra cap on your hair, so I'm not going to go in details of that. I'm just going straight into how to install the this from the last all. I'm not walking straight into how to do the bra cap, how to put the glue because I'm walking into that, so I guess you already know from that moment. So I'm jumping straight into this video. So I already apply my glue, I put the first coat on, second coat on, and the third curl, so I'm about to install this. I am so, uh, you know, I don't have a big mirror, so I'm gonna be looking at this mirror down right here and making sure I'm applying it the right way. I hope you guys are seeing. You gotta make sure you hold it like this so that you don't have to put the lace on the glue because you want to make sure it is at the right position before you tack it down well so you put your hand like this and try to pull it down like this to where you want it to be all right so my hand is all in the night it's at my forehead but not done yet because i'm not ready to put it down and it is not where i want to put it down so my hand is still sticking up and down so I'm carrying it, I'm carrying it very gentle and I place it right there because there where the glue is and I place it right there and then put the other side down, put the other side down. 
so I thought I made sure it is done well. I use some comb and comb it too. Comb it through so you can soak it into the glue. So I'm keeping this in for like uh I will give it five to ten minutes because I want this elastic band to help stick the lace into the glue so you put it on for a few minutes and allow it to soak before cutting the lace out so I took the band out and as you see it's very very down into the glue it sticks so well everything is so good <laughs> when it comes to cutting the lace off the way or whatever when it comes to cutting the lace the excess lace off you don't want to just cut it straight you want to create a zigzag pattern so that example you go like this you go like this you know so you can get a zigzag not to be so you know straight or whatever you want to go that zigzag way so i'm doing like this and just going like this going like this going like this to get what i want to get a zigzag way so Let's get into this. I'm going to, of course, I'm going to bring my head down so that I can look in the mirror and see what I'm doing, okay? So I'm getting into this. Alright. I'm like this. Put my head down. Bring it up. Carry it down. Bring it up. Carry it down. Bring it up. Carry it down. Bring it up. Yep. Good. You can see. Like this side is pretty much good, like how I want it. Like when you cut it this out and then you see that some is not laying flat, you can just take your glue and put it, apply it on your on your forehead and then stick it into it. But for now, it's pretty much glue on this side. Everywhere is flat. So it's this time. On this side, you just do the same thing like you did on the first side. No. So I'm pretty much done with the cutting and everything so I'm just going to take my mousse oh who's sending me some test messages I hope it be some good news okay So there's one thing about this frontal or whatever the hair on the lace is just one inch it's not even one inch it's like half inch like this the hair on the lace like this so there is no way you do baby's hair with this lace because if you try to take a hair over here you will definitely see the tracks so for that reason now see I can do that by it. I'm not gonna do a baby's hair, but just to so just apply my you know, my move, try it back, sit on the try it, let it dry for some minutes and then come out and fly on it. look yeah this is how it came out I love it so much I love this color this is my first time getting color like this like this Halloween yeah I love it it's pretty I don't know if I'm going to make it as my favorite color but I love this color it looks so so beautiful my husband loves it so much and this is it So guys, let me know in the comment section below what you think about this week. I love it. I don't know if it's going to be my favorite, but I love it. So guys, let me know in the comment section below if you love my hair. So, hope it up. Don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe. Please subscribe and make a comment on how you feel about my hair. So, <laughs> alright guys. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.